Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Liz here. It's been <laughs> entirely way too long since the last time I posted a video. Um, and I, I really apologize for that. But honestly, I've just been extremely busy and yeah. So I figured I would kind of do a little life update video so I can kind of tell you guys what's been going on in my life um, and hopefully my goal for 2022 is to get back consistently again with posting videos on YouTube. So um, I kind of figured this would be a little introduction, not introduction, but like update video just to kind of tell you guys like, sorry, what's been going on in my life, what I've been doing the last couple of months because it's been literally since August since the last time I actually posted a video on YouTube. Um, so I kind of just wanted to update you guys on my life. So, um, I honestly don't know what the last thing I told you guys was. Obviously, if you remember, um, I did have a boyfriend and we broke up back in July. Yeah, we broke up back in July. Um, and so basically I've just been trying to kind of get over, um, the situation, get over him, kind of just healing myself internally, um, trying to make sure that like I am the best version of myself. Um, and that's kind of been where I've been at this whole semester. Um, if you didn't know, it is December 23rd and I am sitting in my house in New York. Well, my mom's house. It's not my house. My mom's house in New York um, for the holiday, obviously. Anyways, so that happened in July. Um, I was actually here in New York this past summer. I don't know if you guys watched any of those videos, but I was here in New York this past summer working an internship at... Um, a place in Rochester um, and so we were apart for the summer and you know things just happen it's whatever um, so we broke up I finished my internship up in New York and then I went back to Kentucky for school obviously I go to the University of Louisville so I had to sorry that was my cat um, so oh He's walking his kids down the street in a sled. That is so cute. Okay, sorry. I'm getting si so sidetracked right now. But anyways, um, so in August, I went back to Kentucky to start a uh, fall semester and do cheer and um, whatever else. So that's kind of where I had left off. You guys kind of saw my apartment. Um, I did an apartment tour because I switched apartments. Um, and I live in the same apartment. I can show you guys like when I get home, like the updated, whatever. Um, and then September came, I, um, was just going through school. I was taking, how many classes did I take this year? 15 credits. So I was taking 15 or five classes. Um, I started working at my apartment again, which if you, I don't know if I posted YouTube videos back then, but my freshman year of college, I worked there before it was built. And so now that I live there, I decided to work there again. Um, what else has happened? I've obviously been continued to cheer. If you follow me on Instagram, you've seen all my pictures about me cheering. Um, and in September, I actually got to go to the Wake Forest game in North Carolina. That was super fun. It was like really, it was a really good experience for me because it was right after my birthday. And that was like what I wanted for my birthday, like was to go to this away game. So I was super excited I got to go. Super grateful. It was a really fun experience. Even though we lost, we shouldn't have lost, but it was a great experience. And I was like super grateful to have even gone. So it was a, so fun. Um, and it was fun because it was right, it was like the weekend after my birthday. So I was officially legal. And it was just, it, I mean, I, I didn't really do anything anyways because I'm not a huge like party person or anything like that. But it was just fun because I was finally like, able to be able to drink you know what I mean like not, even if I didn't like it was the fact that I was able to I don't know anyways um and then J October came that was fun um we just we had games and stuff um and that was kind of that we cheered volleyball which is super fun I love the volleyball here at Louisville our w women's volleyball team is well they were number one for like so long um so then October came, my family came to town for our, we celebrated my birthday, but it was really during my mom's birthday. So they all came down to Louisville and my dad came up from Nashville 
and we spent the weekend together in Louisville. We, I cheered the, uh, the football game and then we went down to Nashville and just walked around downtown. It was super fun. I'm really glad that like my brother, <laughs> well, my brother was supposed to surprise me, but I kind of figured it out that he was coming. So that's besides the point, but my whole family got to go. My mom, my dad, my stepdad, both of my brothers and my grandma all came. So it was really fun because it's like the first time that everybody that's like my immediate family was able to come to like a football game and see me cheer and everything and I was just super super grateful that they got to come um because that's honestly all I wanted for my birthday was to just see my family because obviously I hadn't seen anyone since August when I left except for my dad but that's besides the point so then that was uh October the weekend after that was Halloween I finally went out to a party which was super fun um I didn't get super messed up like I was proud of myself like I partied and I like had fun but I didn't get super messed up and then November came um that first weekend in November we had a football game and then it was my like best friend at school her birthday she turned 21 so we celebrated her birthday and then um we kind of just practiced and then we had a showcase um the weekend before Thanksgiving in Lexington that was really fun even though both my flyer and my back spot hurt their hand um so we had a makeshift stunt group <laughs> so we didn't do the first stunt and then the second stunt we had a boy back spot um just because she hurt her hand our back spot hurt her hand so she couldn't do it but it was still really fun and we hit obviously and I'm super gra like grateful for my stunt group and they were, there's a video of them in my last video from like August. Like that's how long we've been together. I love them so much. If you're watching this, I love you all so much. Anyways, um, Thanksgiving came. I watched my friend's dog. I didn't go home. I didn't celebrate Thanksgiving, honestly. I didn't. The weekend after that was the Kentucky game. Um, we cheered that game. Jack Harlow was there. It was super cool. Got to take a picture with Jack. I'll insert it here. Well, it wasn't just me. It was, I was in the picture, but it wasn't just me. Got a picture with Jack Harlow. That was like the highlight of like November was like taking a picture with Jack. Um, what else happened in November? That's that. And then December started. Um, we got to just cheer. Um, volleyball was in the NCAA tournament. So they played their first four games in Louisville. I cheered the very first game. Obviously, they won all four games. They went 32-0, and 0, which is, like, absolutely crazy for a volleyball team. Um, so then when it came to Final Four, they made it to the Final Four in Columbus, Ohio, which was two weeks ago. No, literally a week ago today. That's crazy. It was literally a week ago today. They played the Final Four, and they unfortunately lost to Wisconsin um, in Columbus, Ohio, but it was super fun. I was really grateful to have gotten to cheer that game because, like, cheering a volleyball game of such high caliber is, like, the energy in there was crazy, even if we didn't have very many fans cheering for us, but whatever. Um, it was super fun to cheer with the band in, like, this big hockey arena that was made volleyball. Like, honestly, it was really cool. It was my first time at, like, an NCAA, like, championship anything. So, it was really fun. And I got to stay in the hotel room with my two best friends. Like, it was a really good time. And I think it was, like, a really good experience. So, then, since we lost... Um, last Thursday, we didn't make it to the championships, so we left on Friday, drove back to Louisville, and then I changed my flight to leave Saturday morning, so I literally went to the airport at 4 a.m. No, actually, it was like 4.30. I went to the airport at 4.30 last Saturday, um, flew to Orlando, Orlando to Rochester. I got here on Saturday. Today is Thursday. So I got here on Saturday and the first thing I did was get some Bill Gray's. If you're from Rochester or like Western New York, you know Bill Gray's cheeseburgers are just so good. Literally, that was my one request when I got off the plane. I was as soon as we get in the car and start driving, I'm like, can we make a pit stop? And they're like, where do you want to go? I said, can we get some Bill Gray's because I'm hungry. Also, it was like 3 p.m. and I hadn't ate anything since like 10 a.m. So... It was kind of fair that I was hungry, so we got food, um, it was great, came home, and chilled out, we made cookies, um, like we do every Christmas. My dog is barking, so I need to finish this up, but 
yeah, that's kind of just an update on my life. Um, finished fall semester with a 3.74, I think, um, which is pretty good for me. Honestly, I was expecting a little bit worse. So I'm glad I got the 3.7. Um, and yeah, I'm just excited to be home for the holidays. And then I leave again next Sunday um, to drive back to Louisville. I'm bringing, look at this little man. I'm bringing little baby Duncan. That's my little cat. Um, oops. I'm bringing Duncan back with me. My mom and my grandma are going to drive me to Louisville. They're going to stay like a day or two and then they're going to drive back to New York um, because my car would not make it this far, especially in the snow. So that is that. Uh, it's kind of like an update on my life. Um, I start my internship back in Louisville in January and then I also have the summer internship back here in New York in the summer. So I have a busy like from now until next fall semester ahead of me but I'm super grateful to even have the opportunity to get internships and I'm also super grateful to even be like at Louisville. Like it's crazy to me that I like never even thought I would be here my junior year of high school. Like it's just life is crazy okay. You, I'm just gonna tell you that right now. Life is crazy. Don't ever doubt yourself and don't ever stop like trying for the things you want because you will get them. Like it was crazy. Haven't landed a standing full in like two years, literally since I tried out my freshman year of college and I've been landing them. Like the past couple of months I've been landing them. So it's just crazy to me. Like you can really do anything as long as you try. So moral of the story, try your best and you can do anything you want. But yes, I'm gonna end the video here because I feel like it's already long enough of me talking. My dog needs to be let back inside. But yeah, um, it's snowing outside. It looks really cute. I'll show you guys a clip, but yeah. So um, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys kind of got some like insight. If you have any questions, definitely comment them down below. Um, my goal for the new year, actually, I forgot to mention that. My goal for the new year is I'm going to start my 75 hard again, hard again. Like I already started it once, I didn't finish it. So I'm gonna really, really, really try hard to start it on the first and finish it. It should end sometime in March. Um, so my goal is to like actually complete it and see how I feel so that I'm like nice and like fit for Daytona season. Hopefully I make that. Um, so yeah, that's my goal and I would really like to document that on YouTube. So that's my plan is to kind of just record my like 75 hard challenge um, and then yeah, just post that. Um, but if you guys have any suggestions, definitely leave them as a comment down below. I kind of want to see if I can do like competition vlogs since I'm on Jade this year. Um, we're definitely going to at least one competition. Hopefully we get a world bid um because i would love to compete at worlds this year so yeah if you guys have any suggestions leave them down below other than that don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up um and my socials will all be down below as well i also have a tiktok now i don't think that's on there but i'll add it um so yeah thanks for watching and i will see you guys in my next video bye also this is the newest member of the family this is Duncan. He is Ella's kitten. He was born in August. His mom hates him. Here she comes. But yes, this is my little baby Duncan. He's grown up here so he could grow up with his mom um, while I was away fall semester. And now I'm, hey, she's going to attack you. Um, and now I'm bringing him back home to Kentucky with me after Christmas.